your fans. Give them one piece of advice on aspiring. Uh, my piece of advice is if you have a goal, it doesn't it doesn't have to be music. It's if you have a goal, it can be if you, you want to be a basketball player, poet, whatever it is, you know, um, stay focused. And the thing is, try to meet a lot of people. Try to meet a lot of business-minded people, mm -hmm. you know, because you never know who you may come across. And you might come across that, that one person that might know someone that might know someone that mm -hmm. will introduce you to that person. And, you know, there you are. Mm -hmm. your, your, your goal is reached. So um, number one thing is stay prayed up. Definitely, because yes. uh, without God, I mean, you really, you really have nothing. And and don't think for once that if you do make it, that it's you. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's, mm -hmm. it's not. You know, um, like I said before, meet as many people as you can, because connects can go a long way. Mm -hmm. It's about networking and being business minded. And it's not just about focusing on what you do, focusing on your craft. It's about learning the business, mm -hmm. you know. So once you learn the business and focus on your craft and, you know, stay prayed up and, and do the right things and stay focused, you should be good. Wonderful, wonderful. And, and yeah. what, I, what I would say to everybody, you know, in terms of, you know, if, if, you, if you have a goal, if you have a goal in mind, you know, look at what your goal is and don't just say, okay, I want to be a millionaire. You know, somebody, everybody say to themselves, you know, if they don't have money, okay, well, I want to be a millionaire. But then you have to ask yourself, okay, how do I become a millionaire? What steps do I have to take in order to become a millionaire? Because you can't just snap your finger as you win the lottery or something mm -hmm. to become a millionaire. So you say, okay, you want to be a rap artist. You want to be an R&B artist. You want to be a fashion designer. You want to be a host on TV. You want to mm -hmm. be something in the industry. You basically got to set yourself some goals and set small realistic goals. Don't just say, okay, tomorrow I'm going to wake up and I'm going to be the CEO of Bad Boy Entertainment. Mm -hmm. You know, you got to set small goals and say, okay, I'm going to start here. And then once I accomplish this small goal in terms of maybe networking with some people to, to, to put yourself out there, then you go ahead to your next goal. You know, because everything happens in steps. You're not just going to overnight become a celebrity or overnight become known. It's going to take a little time to get there. And also, just stay positive and, circle, and, and keep yourself in a circle of positive people. You know, mm -hmm. positive people, you know, celebrities in the basement is where we are. Mm -hmm. we, we're surrounded by positive people. Mm -hmm. We're surrounded by it. We're doing positive things. Yes. So if you happen to have that, then that means your outcome is going to be positive. Yes. So stay focused. Keep your mind right. And just, you know, and just, you know, don't hate on anybody else's success. Go out there and succeed yourself. And one that's thing, the bottom line. One thing I do want to say on that one, any inspiring artists, if you contact me, I will help you. Mm -hmm. You know, and a lot of people really won't tell you that. Mm -hmm. They'll just say, contact me. I'll see what I can do because if you're not serious, then I wouldn't even send anything. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. I'll, I'll help anybody that's, that's serious yes. because I remember the help that I was trying to get mm -hmm. with people that wasn't serious helping me, so I had to do things on my own. Yes. You know, so. That's wonderful, yeah. wonderful, wonderful advice. Uh, my heart goes out to these brothers. I love you so much. I just want to say thank you again for visiting me here. Uh, did you have a good time here at Celebrities in the Basement? Oh, I had an excellent time. I want to come back. I, wonder, I don't even want to go home. You know? <laughs> I, 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 I just want to go ahead and just chill. That's what I want to do. You know? We truly had a good time. I truly yeah, enjoy you. Uh, again. I want to thank all of you for also coming into my basement. Again, I want to thank uh, Tommy Brown and his baby brother, Jay Reed, for visiting me here again uh, at Celebrities in the Basement. And always remember, to every one fan, you have two haters. Just stay focused on your dreams and always, always keep God first. Keep the prayers going up. And you know the blessings will always, always come down. Again, thank you. I'm Karen Waller Martin for Celebrities in the Basement. Good night. Okay, this is wild. This is wild. This is wild. I need that. I need that. Oh, okay, okay, okay.
Okay. Six out. Okay. You need the tent? Oh, Tommy Brown uh, throw, trying to go out okay. on us. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm not doing too well here on this game here. Okay. <laughs> oh. Who was the dealer here? Who was the dealer? Right. I think I jinxed it the first one. Yeah. So. The first one. <laughs> yeah, ace out. Oh, wow. Yeah. You need the ace? Oh, okay. We're waiting for the same card, uh, Jay. Let's that's call, that's Wait. What I just did called pump fake, and that okay. made you think I needed the card, yes. but I need that. Oh.